Hi friends. Welcome to 30 Inks 30 Days Day 4. So, as usual, first up, take a look at yesterday's stuff now that it's all dry. That was Black Ivy in this Moon Man M2. I think I have remembered why I don't write with this that much. This is an okay time of year for it. Um, sort of. My hands warm this and thus it burps. Why do we call it burping though? Really? It's more like it, well, it spits. I'm going to say something grosser. Let me have a sip of tea. Okay. So Black Ivy. I love the chromatography. And the splat is just like crazy amounts of sheen. And the writing actually does have a fair amount in this. So to me, so if you look at this splat here where we we dabbed it up, you can see it's like greenish under there. But it mostly comes across as black to me depending on the paper I'm writing on. But yesterday's news. Let's go on to today's as usual. Doing some uh, random stuff to get the color. And it has picked 16. What color is that? Um, Aha! That is Krishna Cassiophora. Let's find you in here. I was just talking to a co worker who is uh, Indian about how to pronounce various Krishna things. Uh, so here's Cassiflora. Well, that's half the battle. We found the card. Now I have to find the vial. I'll pause so you don't have to wait for me to go through this. Okay, I have found the little vial. And I've also picked a pen. So we're going to go with the Coico Sport Frosted Coconut. Broad nib. I wanted, I was gonna, um, I wanted to do a broad nib because this looks like it'll have some good shading. So I got also, I'm a little worried because this looks like it has a dot of ink on it, but we're not gonna let that get in our way. Right? Right. I should have gotten my little sample holder. Pretty decent fill. I'm gonna have to reopen that in a second, but you know. I'd rather do that than have this spill all over. So we'll get this going. You can actually see it on the paper already splitting without water being added. That's pretty cool. I think that water is deeper than usual. Oh, perfect. Okay, we'll get some to our syringe for splats. Right on. Let's 
So, let us, let's go. One of the few pins I post. <laughs> I can't actually write with it unposted, it's okay. Thirty inks, thirty days. Wow, this is so amazingly cool. I'm gonna show you that in a minute. Um, November twenty twenty two, day four. Uh, ink. Krishna, Cassia Flora, Pen, Goikos, Sport. It's the only one I have. I'm not going to put the color B. Sort of the only one I have. The other one I've marked for selling. Here is this chromatography, uh, that little spot in the middle is from the dot of the other ink they got on there, but I don't care, it's still fine. Hang that up to try. Like that. Skipped. So, I'll show you what I thought was cool, as you can see the parts where I've written over the splatters from yesterday, it it changes the color. Ooh, that feels like something to exploit intentionally. So, let's get on with splatting. If you like splats and you don't already watch Amanda B ink splat ink splat slash Amanda B's videos, you're missing out. But I feel like the chances of that are slim. Of you having found my videos and not hers. And being into ink splats. That's a kind of weak one, but I'm leaving it. I'm leaving it. So if I look at this on the camera, is it accurate? I think not. On my camera, it's looking kind of yellow. And this is, if I look at this, the writing on it is sort of a sepia, but it's, it's a yellowy green, but it's green to me. Who knows, maybe my, maybe the children are wrong. Um, but this is today, day four, Krishna Cassia Flora. Um, thanks for hanging out with me this morning while we play with ink and drink our tea. Earl Grey, of course. Um, I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye.